Hey y'all, what's up? In today's video, we are going to show you how to load the roll film and how to load the sheets. So in today's video, right now we have the 24 inch loaded. And if you wanted to unload it, you would have to come to the panel on the actual printer and click on the left button where it has the roll and paper feed. From there, you'll scroll down to cut sheet and the pressurized unit will release once you hit the little circle at the very top. Once it releases, you'll be able to remove the film and insert your sheet. Once you load the sheet, it's going to ask you if you want to keep the settings above or change the film settings. You want to keep the film settings the same because when you switch from glossy to matte film, it's going to switch your black inks from PK to MK and you're gonna waste ink to get it back. So you want to keep your settings on glossy so you can continue to use photo, uh, photo black instead of the matte black and you'll hit OK and it is now ready. Now you want to switch back from the sheet to the roll. You'll hit the side and back up to cut. Once you hit this button, your sheet will drop out and it'll allow you to start doing the process to load the film. At that point, you'll hit the load button and it's going to tell you to put the film in. At that point, I slide it down and hit OK. It'll start to do its thing. For some people, it has to come down to here. I've uh, recently found that it works out me putting it there. If you lower the suction of the vacuum, it's easier to get the film to slide down to the portion it's needed. And once the film is loading, just like before, you want to keep the above settings and not switch from glossy to matte. Even though if you are making the switch, do not switch on the actual printer. And here's where we got the error because I didn't have the film down here. So it's hit or miss with that. You want to make sure the film is down here. We're going to roll this again and show you how that's done. All right, so you're going to bring the film all the way down. If you lower the suction, it is so much easier to bring it down and not have an issue. You want it to about right there. Once that is done, you'll raise the vacuum and hit load. I love the vacuum because it will ensure that this film is not going to hit the top of the print head and damage anything. And just like the standard sheets, you want to keep the above settings because you don't want to switch from PK to MK. Again, it'll waste ink to re-switch it and time. It'll do its thing and it'll let you know when it's ready. That's it. That's all to it, guys. The film has been loaded and you're ready to print. And once again, if you wanted to go back to sheets, it's just that easy. Have a good one.